happy Saturday ah, to my new booze. My name is Erica. Today's video is going to be all, a haul all about kitchen organizing stuff for your drawers, for the refrigerator, for under your cabinet. And I got some awesome kitchen products that I love using, honey. So if this is the video for you, please stay tuned for more y'all welcome to my kitchen Ugh, so y'all i have some old old organizers that i've been using in my kitchen for a very long time since we brought this house even the house before my organizers my organizers are old so i end up going to uh, uh, amazon ross what else tj maxx home goods to pick up some new organizers that I really like so let's jump into it the first organizer y'all this video this is going to be scattered everywhere from the stores because I didn't put it in the store order like I usually would do so this um organizer that I got is a like lazy Susan and I'm thinking about using this for the refrigerator this one and this one was $9.99 and I really like this one because of the handle grip. So when one of my children um, probably want to turn it around, they won't um, dirty up or nothing because of the grip here, it has like a rubber grip on this side, a gray rubber grip. I also brought another Lazy, lazy Susan that I, I'm thinking about putting this one either in the top cabinet over here or under the sink. And y'all, excuse the noise, I do live next to an army air base, so airplanes do fly here and there. And I have also have pets, but my pets, they well trained, they be quiet all the time. So my neighbors have dogs as well, you probably hear them barking here and there. So back to this boo right here. Y'all, I brought this Lazy Susan and I got this one off of Amazon. And I'm thinking about putting the big items that I use for cleaning supplies. I'm going to use this one under the sink. I'm still thinking about it. I'm not sure. So these are the two Lazy Susans that I picked up. This item that I picked up is an egg tray. I really like this egg tray. And I got this egg tray off of Amazon. And it holds 36 eggs. So I'm going to put my brown eggs on top, my white eggs on the bottom. And this was my old egg tray. So your girl got an upgrade. So I have two of these. And I was like, um, boo, even though this is, it's, you know, it's nothing wrong with this. Your girl upgraded to this one. So I said, yes, let me pick up this egg tray because I really like how it looks. It's really nice. It's white. It's sleek. And, you, and it's like a drawer. You just pull it out and it's just for eggs. It's like a drawer versus this one, my old one, it has a top. So I really like the new egg tray that I picked up. Um, my refrigerator to me is kind of small, even though it's, you know, it has its um, little TV on it or whatever. But to me, it's small. So I end up picking up an extra um, drawer space so I can just clamp this to one of the pieces on the refrigerator and it's another extra drawer. I really, really, really need this because I do cook a lot and I do have a lot of stuff in the refrigerator and I thought this was com would come in handy for us. And that's why I picked up another um, slide in drawer spacer. And it does, you see, it does, um, you can just pull it out and it will fit any um space that you have in your refrigerator purchase these two purchases i got from amazon these three right here amazon purchase this i wanted to get this because y'all um when it comes to the fruits i be feeling like the fruit drawer be killing my fruit and vegetables really fast so I'm, I'm thinking, I'm gonna test this out. I'm thinking to put all my fruits inside their own little container. And then I'm going to put it on one, the second shelf and store it like that because my family love fruits um, and not so much vegetables. They do love fruits. I like vegetables, but they do eat carrots and stuff like that, raw like that. But I'm thinking to put the fruits in here like the strawberries the raspberries the blueberries and etc 
in these trays, their individual trays, instead of putting it in the fruit and the vegetable drawer because I guess I'm not doing something right, honey. So I'm gonna put it in here and put it in a top, top shelf and see what that will last my fruits longer versus putting it in that drawer because I think the humidity that I'm putting, setting it on, be killing that thing fast. I try each little section every time we brought fruits and it's like my fruits be and vegetables be dying fast. So I brought this container for fruits and vegetables. This is for the salads. And then this one also for the different vegetables that, um, that we eat. So I brought those two and then when I saw this, the yogurt, it's a drawer, the little yogurts and stuff, I was gonna just put them in here, the go-gurts and yogurts and stuff like that. I was just gonna put it in the drawer as well so it can, you know, hold its own space. Next item that I got off of Amazon is a repurchase. This is a drink dispenser. You put your different drinks in here. Um, the other one that I had, uh, it was a whole five, but it's taking too much space. So I brought a three layer one. So you put your drinks inside and you push it back. As you take a drink out, it pushes the rest of the drinks forward. It's just a nice little white drink dispenser and I got this off of Amazon and I will link these products down below if y'all interested and I'm gonna put a little picture so you can see how it looks. What was the next um, items that I brought off of Amazon is these drawer organizers for your utensils. Four years ago, no, say two and a half, three years ago when I did my kitchen, I brought my first set of um, a knife set off of Ikea when I did this is an Ikea kitchen and when I did my kitchen I brought all things all organizers from from my pantry even in here from Ikea so this is from Ikea this knife set I have a few of these but as I cook more and I you know you're gonna need more stuff so I saw these instead of me going to Ikea and buying more I saw these off of Amazon I can say the Ikea wood if I feeling it now Ikea wood is kind of thicker than this wood so hopefully it will last me a long time so I guess this is for spoons forks and stuff and here is the knife part of it So if you have a local Ikea and you're close to Ikea, you can just pick them up from Ikea or you can order it if you have Prime 2 Day Prime Shipping from Amazon because this is where I got this one from. So the knives are here, your spoons, forks, knives, little spoons and stuff, etc. So I got this one off of Amazon. And I picked up another one for the other spoons and stuff that I have this over here because the girl got more two more but different so this one is the same as the other one but the only different with this one it expands a little bit longer this one does and same goes with the other one I didn't take it out of the box this one expands and those don't the ones that I when I brought one set that expands and, and another set that doesn't. My local Walmart, as usually my local Walmart is two of them here. They really don't be having nothing, so I did go in there to find organizer, but I ended up finding this drawer divider. I wish they had more. This was the last freaking one, so I'm gonna keep looking, keep looking because I do need some drawer organizers. So I did get this for the homes drawer organizer from walmart it's a divider from amazon i brought these jugs so we can minimize the um the juice and then the milk so i brought four of these milk jugs half a gallon of milk jugs and then i brought these condiment um, squeeze bottles one for ketchup mustard marinades and hot sauce honey can't forget that hot sauce boo <laughs> item that I got is 
this dispenser what i'm going to use this dispenser for you know when you um I don't know if you guys make ice cream because I like making ice cream for my children and stuff. So I'm going to put some um, sprinkles or even cakes. You could put sprinkles. Um, so I'm going to put like the dark sprinkles, the rainbow sprinkles, the little chocolate bites and stuff like that. That's what I'm going to do with these little dispensers. And they do come out. So these are just going to be like really cute little goody sweet dispenser. That's why I got this and I got this off of Amazon. Oh, the last Amazon purchase that I brought was this. Um, you can use this for anything, really. It's a dispenser, too. Um, you can put your... I'm going to use it for rice. You can put your... Um, uh, what do you call it? The powder for your washing clothes powders. You can put that in there. But I'm going to use this for rice. You put your rice... I'm going to put my rice inside. And then you press this button. And your rice is supposed to come out and it measure it has a measuring cup and so I can always know um, the measuring size of rice that I'm using because it's only but four of us right now it used to be seven but you know when these children get older they be doing their own thing so um, now I'm cooking for four and a half because my son he is 18 turning 19 and he will be leaving me soon <laughs> This is last year of high school, y'all. Um, back to this. <laughs> I'll be so sentimental. Um, so this, I'm just going to put my rice inside and, and I'm going to dispense it out. So this is it for my rice. Moves on to the next containers. We still have more back here before we get to the cleaning supplies, honey. That's my favorite. Cleaning stuff is my favorite. So I brought um, some more containers here. This, I'm thinking about just putting uh, probably, probably like left water bottles and stuff like that. Whatever I don't put in the dispenser, I was going to put it in the water bottles. This, I was going to put as ice trays for down below here. My nugget ice from my ice maker right here. And then I brought some ice cubes. Um, the silicone ice cube balls. I was gonna put it in here. If this is too big, I said I probably will put it in something like this or this one right here, which it has a top. I think this would be a better choice for ice versus something that's open like this. But I'm trying to say like easy access for the children, just scoop whatever they need. Um, but this one probably be better for the ice. And I got this one off of Amazon. And these came from Ross, so this is a better alternative because this is cheaper versus the um, Amazon stuff. For Ross, these two these two big trays um, containers was five ninety nine. This one was six ninety nine because this is a designer brand. It's in design. I design. And then this one, these are bigger, was five ninety nine. $6.99 for the little, little small one and $5.99 because of the brand. That's why this is $6.99 and because of this, it's just, you know, off brand, it's $5.99. This item is not for the kitchen, but since this is a home organization video, I decided that this is going to be for under my bathroom cabinet. Um, I brought some more. This is from the um, brand Bino. I brought some organizers, a three drawer chest organizer. This was from Home Goods for $16.99. I would, I would re recommend Bino if you see it at Ross, Marshalls, or Home Goods, TJ Maxx. I recommend that brand. And I designed because their quality is very sturdy. And I got this I designed little um, uh, uh, organizer. From I design and I got this one from Home Goods for $4.99. I got this bin, three case set bin from Home Goods. This was $14.99, and I'm going to use this for a drawer organizer, you know, to put my hair products and stuff like that. And another bin, you know, um, two long organizers for my probably for like curlers and stuff like that. And this was $7.99. And I'm going to show you the name of the brand inside if y'all can see. 
And then I brought two large ones. And I'm gonna use this for towels. This is the I'm going to use, use these for a small towel that came in a set of two. This was $12.99 from Home Goods, And here's a big one, which is really thick, thick. But this is in another brand. It's called Storage Bin. This one is really thick. And this was $19.99. And it's really big and it comes in two. So shop your local Home Goods, TJ Maxx, Ross, etc. This one too, I got from Home Goods. Um, I, I ripped off the paper. I should have oh, should have told you the price. I don't think I paid no more than twelve ninety nine for it, and this is a double drawer, so I can be able to organize under my bathroom cabinet. Peak peak slash more organizers. These organizers I got from Home Goods, and this is how I'm going to lay my under my kitchen cabinet. I brought three more which I'm thinking about taking one of these out for the ice tray and put something else up here and then this is just a pull in um, a pull out uh, um, tray for organizing this I got from long time ago I got this from um, Ikea which I can see my kitchen is an Ikea's kitchen. So I got three of these trays to put different stuff here. And then another Ikea thing that I brought, I didn't put it up yet because I need to clean it and organize it better. And then I'm gonna put it here. It's something that I got a long time ago from Ikea. That's what's gonna go in this space. And this is how it's gonna look under here versus what I'm gonna put on top of here. I just gotta find another organizing tray to put on here because I'm thinking about using this one and the other one that I have for ice. I went to the kitchen cleaning stuff, which is my favorite. As y'all can see back here, I have so many cleaning products that we are going to get through y'all sorry for the lighting if y'all didn't know put light against the camera is it gives it a little dark effect versus having a light against that's just fyi so boys, let's get up close and personal with all these beautiful items that i love to clean my house with so we're gonna start off over here with downing oh y'all i love this fragrance of downing this infusion oh yes this is my favorite downy oh, smell i gotta smell it y'all oh i love this smell this one and then it's a pink one with flowers y'all this is ooh, baby for me i love this smell oh there she go mm. and i got this one off of Walmart when I went to a Walmart purchase The next item from Downy is this Downy wrinkle releaser Yes, this gets your clothes. It's just like starch if y'all know what starch is this gets your clothes Really 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 nice laid flat So nice the wrinkles be gone, honey. I really like this and I still like my starch I like my brand starch, but this one it smells good and it also gets your clothes unwrinkled because boo, we don't need to be wrinkled out there. <laughs> so another boo here that I like is Febreze. And I like this to put on my children's clothes, especially the boys. They be smelling like sun, honey. Whew, I can't stand it. Smell like sun. <laughs> If y'all have boys and y'all know what I'm talking about, please thumb this video up because honey, they be playing outside. I smell like, eh, I can't take it. So I do spray this <laughs> on their clothes, on their bed. Oh, this is one of my favorite scents. So I have a couple of these, but this boo here, love it. <laughs> I would say some of them little girls be funky too. <laughs> but on to the next dawn product i really love these um the cotton the cool cotton dawn scents that you can just put inside um your washing machine and it smells so good i love the cool cotton anything that's got cotton um linen of a candle i really like that that fragrance i have dawn 
And my go-to for washing powders and stuff like that is Gain. I used to use um, uh, Tide, but Tide breaks me out. So here is the Dawn brand of what I like of those little scents. So was the next scent that I love for my clothes and my children's clothes, y'all, is the Snuggle, um, the Ocean Blue scent. Oh my goodness. This smells so delicious, y'all. I'm open, y'all. I'm too close to y'all. Mm -hmm. Yes, boo. This one, I love this scent. I also have it in this scent. Let's bring her clothes so y'all can breathe what it is. Take a picture. Mm, snap, snap. <laughs> and I love the Gain one as well. Ooh, yes. Yes, honey. These are the Gain for Breeze Order Remover 3-in-1. It has your Oxy Boost, your Febreze Order Remover, and your Spring Daily Dream scent. Really love it. Yes, it'll get the clothes smelling so good for at least a week and a half. But for my boys, <laughs> for my boys, y'all, what they be doing, honey? <laughs> so the next item that I love using, y'all, I don't have, I don't have a dishwasher because I opt out for the dishwasher for this big old stove best purchase ever because I was like well we don't need that dishwasher because I need the stuff the room for the stove so hey it's a win-win for me I love my stove so but I do still buy dishwashing pods because when this when the sink get full of dishes you could just put two full of water up this is what I do honey you fill the water up you put two of these pots and you let the dishes soak in there for a little bit and then you wash it this stuff gets squeaky clean so I like this brand and I get this from the family dollar and then I like this brand from the family dollar only two dollars this one says four dollars the other one's two dollars or no four dollars then I get cascade from the family dollar and then Cascade again, the Platinum One, and then this brand. I just be picking up from the Family Dollar because, you know, sometimes they have like, even though it reduced price, they take like two, three dollars off even more. So yeah, your boo here don't own no dishwasher to those boos that do. <sighs> I envy you. I just wish I had the kitchen space to put a dishwasher, but I need that stove in my life. <laughs> So since we on to dishwashing stuff, I love my Dawn Platinum Foam. foam. Yes, y'all. If y'all have never tried this, please try it. Please. I use this for my stove. It gets the stove so clean. Scrub it up, dub clean. I love this stuff. So I have it in a soap form too. The Platinum Pine and then the power wash y'all would thank me later with this boo because i clean this boo here i clean the bathroom with her i clean the toilet with her i clean the sink with her i clean the stove with her i clean a stain with her she is my friend my bestie boo this boo right here please you cannot go wrong with her so on amazon I brought a Clorox kind. Let's try her out. This will be the first time I try this Clorox band, brand, but this um, Clorox um, situation of that, y'all, when it comes to anything clean, I am a Clorox girl. Yes, Clorox is a very, very, very strong, strong chemical to be using, but I grew up with her. I know her. She is my mama. Boo, she's older than me. Clorox will always be in my life as long as God let me live. So, boom. Please don't come for me because I use Clorox on my clothes, my white clothes. I use Clorox to wash my floor. I use Clorox to wash my dishes. I use Clorox to clean the stove, the stains. Boo. Just don't put Clorox on color stuff. Mm. 
So another Dawn Free and Clear. This is a clear kind. I never tried this. I don't know what the difference between this. All I know this is scented and they have another blue one that's unscented. So what's the difference? They both say degrease five times. I guess it's just clear. Who knows? But I pick her up as well. So those are another dish items that I love to clean my dishes with. And I got from Amazon is these packet of sponge. Y'all, these are not expensive. And I go through these a lot. Every four days, I do either, I toss these things out. And then this is for the pots. I don't just only use this to clean my pots. This is from Amazon too. Y'all, I love these things because Amazon has it so many in here for a less price. And you can always toss these out and these as well. So keep your pots clean and sanitized. So, boos, let's go on to surface cleaning product. Oh, it's my Clorox wipes. <sighs> I use these babies everywhere, and I pick these up either from um, Sam's, BJ's, or Amazon. This time, I got them all from Amazon. I got three packs, and I will put everything in the description on how much I pay for them. So this came off from Amazon. I got three packs of Clorox wipes and you can clean them. You can use these things anywhere and it does not smell like Clorox Clorox. It does have a nice scent to it. Another surface cleaner product that I love is my boo right here in my yards. You can get it from Target. And I got this from Amazon. So I got all these different scents off of Amazon for a good little price honey <laughs> so I got all these scents and I do love these are my two favorite scents I'll show you guys right now these two is my two favorite scents here's this one and then the other one is my two favorite scents and then the one over here the other ones I can tolerate it I don't mind it but those are my favorite ones out of this brand so the next surface cleaner that I got from Walmart is this brand here. Bam, bam, bam. Do it have the brand on here? No, it doesn't. Sorry, boos. So it's this, and it looks like this bottle. It has a teardrop of water. You can use this for your kitchen, bathroom, and your bedroom. This is an all-purpose um, surface cleaner or all-purpose cleaner and it's um not harmful and it's really good so this one is also all purpose that i love and i got this off of amazon and it's a refillable multi-purpose spray solid surface cleaner so you all this is like refillable you just come in a spray and you just use their little pods um as it goes so check this boot out here i really like her as well so, boo, the next cleaning product that I love is something that I grew up on. Bam! It's for the windows. This is the Windex, baby. Who who grew up on this? Mm, this is something that I grew up on. I love Walmart. And this is something that, as I got older, I got hooked on. Another glass cleaner. Y'all, I like this too. Oh had to get it love it love it love it love it i love this glass cleaner as well but here is a new boo that i've been using in my kids bedroom is this glass cleaner mm, yes this one so i had to repurchase this one because i really do like how it gets the glass done the job done and get the glass squeaking clean um if i was to choose out of the three these two for me so we move on uh, this is vegetable wash and I got these three off of Amazon and yes honey this vegetable wash do get your vegetables and your fruits clean so booze yes rinsing them under the water under the sink is good but take it another step over because after that one time that I saw a worm coming out my apple 
I say, oh no, I'm going to always wash my vegetables and my fruits. And this is what I've been using ever since. And it's been some years now. So honey, get you this vegetable and fruit wash. All right. Y'all going to thank me. Rinse it off. Spray. Rinse off. Toss it. And you're good. So bulls, introducing one of my best cleaning products for my stove. For any gunk. Y'all, I use this stuff on everything. Like that lady, that old lady on Red Hot, I use that on everything. So, boo, these two products, it says it's for stove and grout. Y'all, especially this one, I use this thing on everything. Everything oily, sticky, gunky. Uh, I love this, boo. Oh my gosh, this too. This is my favorite. This one right here, I use her on everything. She's my boo, she's my bae, she's my everything, she's my best friend. Oh, uh, honey, get y'all this. Y'all gonna thank me if y'all spray this on everything. It's gonna get up. She got up on some, I had a stain on my counter, on my uh, cabinet, and it was like oil stain, cause my, okay, my son, I have this, the deep fryer. So you know it's oil in the deep fryer, so when he put the deep fryer up, I'm gonna show y'all a video because I did record. I was like, look what this fry did. He, um, I put the dish deep, he put the deep fryer up, and some of the oil from the deep fryer was like getting inside the cabinets. And then I was like, it's hard to get up oil things. So I got this here. I sprayed her down. I let it sit for a little bit. Honey, she got that thing up. Mm, yes, this boo right here. This one I spread on grout. I spread on my um my little uh floor and everything and I get her up. The porcelain, the cement tile, yes, honey, she is the the, the truth when it comes to the the shower in the, the bathroom area in the kitchen area. This is uh, this is my boo for that. But this one here, she get that thing up. So speaking of bathrooms. <laughs> We got this here, this da -da -da -da, toilet boat one. Hmm, I love her because I have three males in this house, and when they go to the bathroom, uh, I can't stand it. But putting her in the cut of the toilet right there, I don't have to do too much work, honey, because she saved me. This boo right here. She, I love her. So I had to get more toilet wands. Mm, get you one, please, boo. So speaking of bathroom products, <laughs> y'all, I had to grab another, what do they call us, a wedgie? <laughs> a, a squeezy, squeezy, I think they call this. Let me see if it's on the box. And I just say all purpose. <sighs> This is for, I use this for the shower, the um, outside of um, the windows, and I just get the dot job done. I already have two of these, so now I have it in gold because I'm changing my kitchen to white gold and etc. So I got a gold one. This one, hopefully it works just as good as the other ones. It looks like it, it is going to work really good because the, um, the, rubber on here it is sharp if y'all can see she probably gonna squeeze that water down really good so booze on to the next items we're gonna get these booze out the way is these two y'all i live next to a lake we have alligators in our lake honey we have bugs back there in my backyard if y'all watch my videos, y'all will see how big my backyard is. And we have critters. And critters come in my house, which is those freaking spiders and all. Oh, and then Florida, with these mosquitoes and flies, you cannot keep your door open because they entering. So, I brought these two products to kill them. Those little pests. <laughs> so, I brought this one. 
this product and then dun, 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 Ray be having a behind running but the difference between the other raid and this one this is not as stronger strong as the other raid when it comes to the smell the the original raid I was put a picture the you know the original raid that we grow up with that I grew up with in my household when I was little that stuff used to be hella hella strong so this one i feel like it's not that as, as strong for my pets or my children and it's not that harmful so that's why i got these two because it's not going to be strong for the pets or my children see i can take that the other way but when it comes to them i'm trying to be a little bit you know caring for their feelings and their insides so <laughs> That's why I picked up these two for them little spiders that be coming in my house, y'all. Oh, and them little wormy thingies. Ah. So, y'all, let's talk about the floors. Only product that I don't have right here that I love is Fabuloso. Oh, I love my Fabuloso. They smell so good. But, in my Pine Saw. Fabuloso is not here. And Pine Saw, <sighs> love it. But what they do have for all purpose, and I do use this on my floor, and you can use this anywhere, it's all purpose surface. I got this off of Amazon, three of them, and it's this Lysol Clean and Refresh. Yes, I love that, but I do mainly use that for the flow. And for the wet jet. Pew, 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 pew. I love this stuff on my floor as well. Especially the upstairs floor because the upstairs floor is kind of it's like a wool wood gray wood porcelain tile so this is good for the upstairs floor and it's also safe on hard wood floors as well we, we move it along so these are the pads for this boo right here and then because I like this scent and it doesn't come in the bottle, I brought these easy to put on um, for the bathroom or for the tile floor down here or upstairs. The little Clorox Swiffer um, little pots, I mean pads as well. So I have two of that, two of these. Talk about Swiffer again. You know the dust for the fans. I brought this too for the dust and the fans. I need this. Oh, I really need this because it gets so dusty and I ain't got time for all that because I have children with asthma and we ain't got time for them to be, <laughs> I can't breathe. No, let's start dusting this house down. Boo. Let, let's get it together. That's why I got more of these. So we'll move along. We are going into uh, let's go into this book right here. It's a CLR garbage cleaning disposal, the garbage disposal cleaner. It makes your inside your garbage disposal really fresh. I have this friend, and then I have some that has like little balls. It's lemon can, y'all. I really like this brand instead of the little ball ones. So I'm gonna show you guys the little ball ones that I'm talking about. I can't find the ball ones. So when I do find it, I will show you guys. But other than that, guess what? These are my favorites. These are the Grove All-Purpose Cleaners. If y'all know what this is, this is um, a monthly subscription and it's, is I'm saying that right? Grove Collection. And I have the All-Purpose Cleaner. This is their glass cleaner. Trouble, where's the other one? There's two more. Glass cleaner, tub and tile cleaner. I have so many. Uh, and this is their floor cleaner. So I have all their concentrated cleaner. All you have to do is pour this in a bottle and then add water. So I have all of these. So the next item that I love to use for my pots is SOS. Oh, who don't love SOS? I grew up on SOS to clean your pots. And then this brand, Burlo. <laughs> Burlo. <laughs> it sounds like a drink. So, Burlo and SOS, if I was to choose which one is best, 
this fool right here, she wins. But I still like using her when I can't find her anywhere. So second choice, first choice. And so S is the best for me. New product that I discovered two years ago is Scrub Daddy. Mm -hmm. Yes, I just learned about this boo two years ago because I was watching something on TV. It was like um how they first got started. Like a billionaire type show that I was watching and Scrub Daddy was on there. And I was like, oh, let me pop that on Amazon. Let me see if I could buy it myself and try it out. And there you go. Bam. So it used to be just yellow like this. And as they got popular, they started making other colors. This gray one here. And then they start making other products, which is this powder paste. This is my third time ordering this glue right here. Oh, yes. And then this is like, um, you know, Mr. Clean Dry Erasers. Here is Scrub Daddy Erase. It's called Erase Daddy. So I got some of these and it comes 10 in a pack. So yeah, I mean, you can use this 10 uses, not 10 in the pack. So it's two in the pack, 10 uses. And this is Scrub Daddy. Yeah, just like Erase from Mr. Clean. This is just the same. But if I was to choose which one, both. So speaking of more cleaning supplies, surface cleaners. We need the rags. How are we gonna clean these products without the rags? So I brought these microfiber cloth off of Amazon. And it's 12 by 12. And it came in a 24 pack. And this is where I clean my surface off, and my stainless steel, and it gets the job done. And I have this color in pink. I have this color in gray and now in beige. This tool here, more microfiber cloth is in white. And this one I use for, you know, like light cleaning. But I do put these away when I have guests over, when I want to use, you know, white cloth. Be a little bougie or whatever. Yes, I use these when guests is over. Over, over here. <laughs> so I also picked up from Walmart um, some stove um, pot holder pads in gray to come in a pack. And then also from Walmart Better Homes is some cloth, decorating cloth rags to hand me in to get wrap that pot. So you don't burn your hand and some dish rags but I use this for surface cleaners also from Walmart so bulls these are the last and final products that I picked up I'm just tell y'all this I'm all for my bulls to be cute and bougie every now and again so these last products is to be cute and bougie when you have having guests to come over and they spill something and you be like, oh no, um, you ain't gotta grab them Clorox wipes. Just, you know, just pick up that Wynn Sonoma spray and wipe down. <laughs> and wipe down your product, you know, whatever you spill. So that's me. So y'all, these products are expensive but i love it for that reason for holidays for guests when you want to take out your fine china and your fine hey your fine um cleaner products as well so the first item that i got from william sonoma is this all-purpose spray let's bring the light down so y'all can see this scent here is my favorite i love this scent and it's from Williams Sonoma and this spray is $9.99. Y'all, I really, really, really love this scent. And it looks nice. So I brought two of those. My favorite for the kitchen. Usually I use this for my bathroom. 
in this one for downstairs and one for my bathroom but this scent here i use for the kitchen anything lemon kills off certain smells when you're frying food or even when you do you not know, have seafood lemon will kill off the smell so i brought two lemon scents multi-purpose spray and then they did not have the lemon in the dishwasher form i mean the dish um soap form so i just ended up buying this um scent in the dishwasher scent so i also picked up hand soap oh i didn't tell you the price of the dish soap that didn't have a price oh Oh, it's $14.99 for this dish soap. Oh. $14.99. Oh, my bad, shoddy. <laughs> and then I picked up hand soap from the same fragrance. They stretch out the price. Well, here's another. This is a lotion. So I guess this hand soap will be the same price of this lotion, which is $14.95. So this is the hand soap and this is the lotion. So then I brought concentrated dish soap. So what the lady told me, which is $9.95, what she told me you can use half, like from here. And then if you have a jar, like she used this as an example. She said you could pour this amount here into a size jar like this and then put all water and then it will be equal to one of these. That's what she told me. We're gonna test that out to see. So I also brought these two concentrated soaps, the lemon one and then the other one. And these was $9.95, the concentrated soap. And then they had a new line coming out was Jazz. This one, I love Jasmine. And it's a lotion. And it comes in a glass bottle. And I'm going to use this for the kitchen. What about? I'm not sure. But this lotion smells. It was in the kitchen aisle. All this stuff is in the kitchen from home aisle from um, William Sonoma. Oh, y'all, that smells so good. And it makes your hands feel. You, you see that? It's like gliding. Oh, it feels so good. Oh. And this item was. Hmm, there's no price on here. Oh, I'll let y'all know. So here's the brand from William Sonoma. Here's the scent. And. Y'all probably could look it up, but I'll put everything down below. So I had to sneak this boo in here because we're talking about kitchen stuff. This is from Bath and Body Works. This is $7.50. This right here, get I spray this mainly inside the garbage can. Oh, oh, oh. Inside the garbage can, inside in inside the dish, the garbage disposal. I get it. I put up spray the garbage can close the lid and let that smell absorb all that stink and then i do the same thing with the garbage disposal i spray inside put the top over it and then let all that soak in so these are the products that i love so i have to like put this in here just in case you guys either have this brand of coffee maker or even have coffee makers so it's good to clean your coffee maker. This is a filter for my coffee maker. I have other filters from my other coffee makers and I keep my stuff clean. So this is something, a good alternative that you can use, not just for this brand in particular, you use it for this brand, but the other ones. Try to also keep your coffee makers clean, your microwave clean. They have all types of stuff to clean your microwave, your coffee makers and stuff like that so you can be able to have your stuff last for a long time so y'all those are all the cleaning products that we went through so boo if you feeling bougie go to Wimson I will give grab you a couple of pieces and boo it's not gonna hurt 
so booze this is it for today's haul i hope you guys enjoy the video y'all i have so many cleaning items that i do love but these are the items that i'm always gravitating to or always repurchasing and repurchasing and repurchasing so i will say they like my you know little favorites or whatever but i do have other cleaning items that i do love but i don't use them as much as these products oh lordy y'all i have so much mess that i have to clean up and i will be using these products especially in my kitchen area right now since i am trying to redo the whole kitchen so you guys if you guys love this type of video please thumb this thumb this video up please like and comment honey uh, and subscribe if you haven't and i will see you guys on the next one which will be me organizing this stuff ah yes honey organizing things ah, of today's video. Mm. So let's take a sneak peek of one of the projects that I need to do, which is my toilet and refrigerator. Y'all, ah, that's, that's my boo right here. That's my face. Mm. She be playing the music. She be letting me watch YouTube. She be doing her thing, but she is small as heck. Y'all, let me, y'all gonna enter this refrigerator yes we are booties so this refrigerator is jam-packed and that's not good look tell me that i don't need to organize this mess she is a mess she needs to be organized we already have organizers in here y'all i had to take some out to put this stuff in look 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 who don't cook and drink coffee? Y'all, we be, we be eating up in this house. <laughs> and I gotta do all this. Clean up. <laughs> yes. This is why I need those organizer bins for this refrigerator so I could get my house in order and get these children in check. Now that they older, they understand a little bit much better. So, now that they older and they understand and they know mama ain't playing that stuff no more they ain't finna just have me here cleaning 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 yes when it was little it was like uh, you didn't have no choice but now that they older they, they they gonna get it together we all gonna get it together and get this house organized like how i want it when it comes to the pantry when we did the house i can say my babies kept the pantry really nice so after all of this gets straightened up i will show you guys my pantry that i do love and that they do keep up since they was little but this is all the stuff that i showed y'all guys today that i need to clean up because mm, y'all this is a hell of a mess y'all see that behind the scenes is no joke you do a video, you clean up, you put the stuff away. I need to get my house in order. <laughs> so, booze, I hope you guys really do enjoy this video that I put for you guys. Oh, I have so many more videos to come, which is my candle haul and everything that make your house smell good. Just like how you love perfume, honey. You got to have your house smell perfumey too as well. Your house needs the perfume as well. So you need to keep your home smelling good, looking good. And mm, just like how you smell good, look good, taste good. Everything in here in your home has to do the same. So booze, I hope you guys enjoy this video. Until the next one. Pray for me, please. I gotta clean all this mess up. Ah. My foot on the neck, my foot on the gas.